We've been hearing more horrific stories about what the Chinese Communist Party has been doing to the Muslims of Xinjiang. The worst part of this entire crisis, this genocide, is all of those countless people who can't come forward because of the families that are left behind and who would be persecuted even more if they did speak up. The people who do speak up, speak up at a great cost to themselves. One of the stories which today really stuck out was the story of Ms. Dorsen. She is somebody who was tortured and while being tortured, while going through all of that pain and immense, you can imagine, distress, she was also interrogated. And when she was asked, it, asked if she believed in Islam and she replied that she did, she was tortured even more. To the point that she had to, she was forced to basically say she's not Muslim. She doesn't believe in religion. This shows you the intent of the Chinese Communist Party. Their issue is truly with Islam, which is why Muslims across the world need to understand this isn't just an ethnic, uh, this, is, this isn't just an issue to do with an ethnic separatist issue. This is to do with Islam in of itself and the hatred of the Chinese Communist Party, this godless, vicious, brutal party against the religion of Islam is no longer hidden.